It's time. We want to see the baby. Bring the baby to us. We have a challenge of the day. I know we don't. I'm still figuring it out. We don't have a challenge of the day. Challenge of the day. It is official. We have an official challenge. So you can't comment on the video, so we're gonna have you go comment over my TikTok as usual. Now, what the challenge is, something huge, drastic has changed on one of our family members. Maybe a physical feature, I don't know, but if you can guess who and what, go comment on my TikTok, my most recent one, I don't know why I'm like signaling a plane to come home right now, but we will be doing shout outs in our next YouTube video. I, yeah, I'm just gonna do it, who cares? Makes so we're gonna shout out your TikTok on one of our YouTube videos. Don't come for me about my outfit right now. I got home from school and I didn't feel like changing my, sh my, my shirt, so I just changed my pants, it doesn't match, and I know that. <laughs> Thanks for your <laughs> Maybe that was the thing I was talking about. Maybe not. Let's yeah, see. maybe it was. Maybe or maybe it wasn't. it wasn't. We're still waiting for the baby. Oh. School. Today. How was it? Hungry. Hungry? <laughs> they ran out of chicken sandwiches. Yeah, and you text your mom and say, Mom, can you come pick me up? They're out of chicken sandwiches. Yeah, well, I didn't eat today at all. Me either. I but for that. real, they had chicken tenders. Why couldn't you just no, have that? No, I don't think you understand. Like, take a frozen chicken tender, put it, put water on it, and uh -huh. then put it in the microwave. Uh -huh. And then rub it in a couch for five minutes. Yeah. And then put it in a tray. Oh, I know what school nuggies taste like. They taste disgusting. Exactly. And it's not like, like that's the only reason I get school lunches because they have chicken okay, sandwiches. Okay, but yeah, I'm gonna and the girl before me got the last one. Let me tell you something. When I when I was in school, back in my back day. in my day, I couldn't even text my parents I want to go home. You know what I had to do if I wanted okay, to go home? Well, thank I God had you to pretend now. that I was sick. So I would act sick, I would go down to the nurse's office, they would call mom, and mom. I'd be like, mom, come get, get me, I, oh, I just wanna go home. All right, everybody, I want to welcome the newest family member to the Smelly Belly TV Pets. He's a little shy, he's super cute, he's super friendly and super adorable, and we're gonna tell you guys all about him in this video. But here he is. He's a little baby boo. Yeah, Ada, you wanna tell him that his name? Peanut. Well, we actually don't know if it's a boy or a girl yet, mm -hmm. but what's his name? Peanut. Peanut. Hey, Peanut. It's you guys, sweet. this is like the sleepiest, cutest little peanut ever. Hi, Peanut. So we're going to be putting Peanut to the test today. He's going to be doing all sorts of different types of ferret challenges. But before we do, we're going to tell you the story of how Peanut came into our family. So basically... You want to tell him, Ada? Sure. We went to Extreme Exotics, and the next day we got him. <laughs> wow, I can tell a better story. Than we that. did our research, though. We did our research. We went to Extreme Exotics. We looked around. We saw that he was really cute and cuddly. We waited a day, and we made sure that, like, Peanut was going to get along with our other ferrets and how to kind of adapt them all together. And Ada does such a good job at taking care of our ferrets. So, like, Tara and I were like, definitely yes you can get another ferret because she does amazing she's so responsible for these ferrets and i just think like i'm very impressed because when we first bought them i was a little nervous that i was gonna end up having to do the care like all the time but ada really does it and we just get to have the fun everybody else in the family just gets to have the fun so um that's why we got peanut and we're gonna show you guys how peanut that's gets along peanut with all Yes, Peanut was all alone at the store. So, and if you guys know about ferrets, they love to be around other ferrets. So um, that's that's mainly why we got him. So your plan with Peanut this time around is to try to do a raw food diet for him, right? Yeah. For him or her. Okay, so because <laughs> Yeti and Bear, Yeti and Bear, they um, do not eat raw food. They just will not. Why do you think that is, Bears? Because they've they just been on it for so long, right? So long they won't. They, I the tried pellets. the whole meat thing. They wouldn't even eat it or look at it. Or right. I know. They were like, they looked at it like, oh, yeah. We tried to do the thing where you mush their food so. in water because it's supposed to simulate them eating mushy meat. 
didn't um, work. Nothing worked. I think they didn't just, work. we got them, they were older. So yeah. we were already like used to this other diet and we tried for a really long time, but we are gonna work, we're gonna work with this little baby. Yep, so. we're gonna see if Peanut yeah. is gonna, and maybe Peanut will eat raw and teach Yeti and Bear that it's okay. <laughs> we're also about to go run to the pet store and we're gonna get little Peanut a couple of different things because he's so excited to be with us. Ada, I didn't even tell you this. So when I went to let Peanut out of his bed this morning while you were gone at school, mm -hmm. all he wanted to do was like follow my shoes. <laughs> yeah. He was like on top of my shoes. Does he follow you around too? Yeah, he literally like follows anyone that is mildly nice to him. Yeah. <laughs> he's like, he's like, oh, you pet me. I'm following you around. Yeah, exactly. Cause like he had, like Yeti and Bear don't really have any interest in me at all. But Peanut is like. He always has yeah. interest in like everyone. He likes to like bite my feet. Yeah, he's so Look cute. At Look at that, guys. He's irresistible. Look at that little cute face. So we're all just kind of chillaxing before we go to the pet store. We're getting dinner ready. So we're doing some steak, and we're doing some shrimp, and you know. And some fish tacos, yeah. Yeah, and some fish tacos. Um, we got a new setup outside, you guys. I got to show you real quick. I got myself a brand new setup. This is a Blackstone with a uh, griddle top. And then in here, these are air fryers, so we can air fry whatever food we want. And then we also got a warming tray right there. You may be thinking to yourself, Jesse, why do you need another grill when you already have a grill? Let me show you guys this grill. This was at one point, I think, a pretty amazing grill. Um, to replace it is very, very expensive, so I haven't done that yet. This grill gets super, super hot, and I think that's because I have liquid propane and not natural gas, so there needs to be a conversion kit for this that I think they never installed, um, so it's just not working out for me, and we're not ready to remodel out here. So, you know, in the meantime, I'm gonna get this Blackstone set up, and we're gonna be cooking us up some good food! I'm a sucker for packaging. Like, this makes me want to buy this and eat it myself. Ew. It's called a lunchbox. Like, isn't it cute? Could we feed it to our beta? I don't know. They eat, like, they like to eat stuff like that, like fish and. Yeah, it's like blood worms. Ooh. Remember, Rory was always talking about that. They like throw up on you. They're like. They do, yeah. yeah. The stores always have a limited, like, ferret thing, Ada, so I think cat toys would be a good option, right? <gasps> Cause they like to chase toys. Yeah. I like them too. Are you gonna try to feed it in a baby bottle? A baby <gasps> oh, we bottle? should get a little baby bottle what for him. What do you him. eat it? Just for fun. Milk? No, we just give him water in there. Oh, that would be cute. His parents are lactose intolerant anyways. Yeah, true. So yeah, we could give him a little we'll bottle. Like Where's the remote? I need control. <laughs> <laughs> I totally scratched that. <laughs> <laughs> I would too. <laughs> Can this get me out of here? Look at this. Whoa, the toys have come a long way. They wind up themselves. What in the world is this world coming to? I, th I don't think that's how it works, Jalen. Yeah, good try. Oh, oh my we gosh. found this little thing of sushi. You have to get that for Bye. peanut. Now look at the cute cactus bed. He could sleep in here that's while he's so cute. running around your room. That yeah, is so cute. Actually, love in a little bed. You should get them a bed to all cuddle up in. I should. The cactus one is super cute. The cactus one is really cute. Oh yeah, that is cute. And it would fit all. And they could all fit and cuddle. I love well, it. You could get a unicorn. Ah, uh, no, we're past a that. Unicorn. Unicorns are for babies. Yeah, how I am a unicorn, so I love them. Let's have the smelly belly and try it out. See if they like it. What do you guys think? Cozy in there? Are yep. you guys doing okay in there? I think they you like it. Right? I think they like it. It looks nice. Meow Awana for cats. What in the world? <laughs> it's really cool. <laughs> it's catnip. This is hilarious. Should we get this and dry it on Aspen? Yeah, let's yeah. get it's it. It's the for catnip Aspen. potty mix. Must get a pickle. We must get a pickle. And it has catnip in it. Well, I've been doing these funny things, but Jayla, this one is actually you. I get bored with humans. It's very true. <laughs> You do. Uh, <laughs> do the walk. Do the walk. Uh, 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 uh. <laughs> Great, we got our cactus bed all filled with goodies. Being totally unprofessional today. The battery's dying. The battery is dying. I repeat, the battery's dying. We do not have a backup battery. We do not have a backup battery. Let me go see if there's any cats to adopt. Empty. Empty. Where are all the kitties? 
I just want a kitty to adopt. We are having a major first world problem. The great debacle. The great debacle 2021 One. on Smelly Belly TV. And we gotta go quick, because as I said earlier, the battery's dying, we do not have a backup. I want everybody to vote, even though we can't do polls or comments, just vote with us. Should we go for functionality and looks? Or just functionality and fun. Wait, we wouldn't be able to get both? You want both? Yes. Ooh, ha <laughs> ha. She wants both. What do we do? Um, what do we do uh, about this? I don't know. <laughs> Debacle. I'm gonna let you guys decide. This is your first time meeting me. You may not already know my answer. But if you know me, you know me. What am I gonna say? Yes. Get both. Oh, get both. <laughs> Same <laughs> thing. A bird kebab. All right. Pets are our friends, not our food. Guys, get out of here. You're not allowed to touch the lock. They're gonna start saying something over your husband, and then we're gonna be kicked out forever, and we can't be kicked out forever because we have a lot of pets, and we need to shop for them. You do know the code, little lady. You know the code? <gasps> You're gonna let all the birds out. I need the code first. Oh, first, we're gonna turn that. First, I know the I'm code not, first. I'm getting away. Okay. No. I will not be a part of this. Breaking the rules, breaking into things you're not supposed to, mm-mm. All right, so Ada, do you want to explain to them like what you've been doing? Well, nothing. They just been like this. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so bear. So bear and peanut. And peanut. Yeah, they get along really good, which is actually really cool because Yeti is more solo. He likes to hang out by himself and just chill. And bear um, and peanut are cuddlers. They love to cuddle. And look, when they sleep, they are like sleeping. Out. <laughs> but he's fine. He's just fine. He's just he's look tired. That. <laughs> that's just how tired he is. Look at him. Oh, look at Bear. He's like, that's my baby. Look at him. Oh, but he's he's good. You could swear when they're sleeping, they look like they're dead sometimes. When we first got the ferrets, the guy told us, don't be alarmed if your child comes down freaking out because she thinks her ferret has died. Yeah. He was like, do not be alarmed. They sleep like dead. <laughs> they do. They look like they're dead when they're Aww. sleeping. It's pretty scary. Are you nice actually. to the new baby? So, Are you nice to the new baby? Yeti is very nice to the new baby. I don't know. Ada said he was roughing up Peanut a little bit. Was he? Yeah, Yeti's testing, testing Peanut. He was just playing a little too rough. Well, they're in like separate areas for most of the most of the well, time. So they're on, there's we supervise, so we've got cage. Peanuts Cage right here, and then, you know, Yeti and Bears is right here. Eventually, they're all gonna stay in here, but we wanna make sure that, um... They're all used to each that other. That Yeti, Spaghetti, <laughs> is getting along with Peanut. He's the wild Peanut one. butter. All right, it's time to cue the most adorable ferret montage ever. Ferrets love to run around in Ada's room while she's gone. So basically, this whole entire space is kind of their home. Um, they're not really locked in their cage very often. And look at this bedside table. I think you guys saw at the pet store, but this bedside table is so cute. Uh, so we have like ferret sleeping zones throughout Ada's whole entire room. <laughs> we have this ferret sleeping zone. This is a new one right here. And so now, yeah, our sleeping zones are going to be complete. And um, we also gonna... choose where their sleeping zones are. So sometimes yeah. you might find Yeti like under a random object, tucked in a random sweater. Yeah, whenever I leave sweaters or uh, towels on my floor, they both go. They, they like, like to burrow. Like, yeah, we'll see. We'll <laughs> see like where they're gonna. You're gonna have like a hard time finding them. It's, it's already because they're gonna be. There's so many hiding spots yeah. now. <laughs> There's so many. I just realized it came with a little soy sauce packet, Ada. Oh, no, it's so I didn't cute. notice that before. <laughs> it's literally the cutest little thing ever. All right, All right. Peanut. Look, I'm gonna stick him right here in my pocket. Because <laughs> he, they love like little spaces they like do. this. And he can breathe just fine. I think he's becoming really attached to Bear, though. You see him? Look at this, guys. Oh, buddy. There's another ferret sleeping zone. There we go. This is an on-the-go sleeping zone. <laughs> on-the-go sleeping zone. So we're going to see if we can get Peanut to go in this sleeping zone over here, which I'm pretty sure he's going to he's gonna have no problems doing that. He's already sleeping in my pocket. <laughs> All righty. All right, you ready, Peanut? There you go, bud. What do you think? 
You want Bear to come with you? Do you like it? He's like, where's my partner? Go get Bear. I'm gonna go get your partner. We're gonna go get him. All right, buddy. Peanut is waiting for you. Oh, I think they're gonna be happy about Bear, this. Bear, you're so lazy. <laughs> they're so lazy because they've been playing all day. Oh, hi. You guys are gonna cuddle up? Bear's trying to get comfy. He's figuring it out. All right. Let's see how this is gonna go. Oh, <laughs> now Peanut's like, all right, you guys done woke me up. You're in for it. <laughs> That's so I think they're going to love it. I think they will. <laughs> he rolls over a lot. Like yeah. Yeti and Bear don't roll over like that. He just like rolls and rolls. It's so yeah. cute. Look, buddy. Oh, see if he likes the toys. <laughs> he keeps going for Bear. Bear, get your fat butt up there, boy. <laughs> Little chunky monkey thick with three C's, boy. Dang, he thick. just about had a heart attack. I thought Ada's room was haunted for a second. So I'm just standing here minding my business and I feel something jump onto me and then bounce off. And I'm like, what was that? And I see nothing. And then there's Peanut. He flew, he jumped from the bed onto me, but then he couldn't grab on. So he just bounced off. What the heck? Okay, cat toys are a win. Get your ferrets cat toys, they love them. <laughs> this is so cute. I've never really seen them play like this before. Yeah, neither have I. Yeah. Like they just- Like with the toy. Right, they usually just kind of roam around. They're actually playing with it. Oh, Peanut yeah. is the one that really likes to play though, huh Peanut? Yeah, cause him is still a little baby boo. <laughs> They're gonna sleep good tonight. Look yeah. at him. Oh my goodness. <laughs> It is that time of the day to say our favorite parts of the day. Um, no, we probably won't be doing this every video, but it's fun when it's more of like a vloggity vlog, day in the life, to say our favorite parts of the day. And I already know mine. My favorite part of the day was definitely watching the ferrets interact with the cat toy, especially Yeti, because Yeti's usually not my favorite, because he's a little crazy, but he's being super cute today, so I have to give him some love. Ada Bear. <laughs> My favorite part of the day was like the same thing. Like I loved seeing the ferrets like, interact with the toys, especially yeah, because I've never seen him like play with the toy. Yes, he's usually just kind of like a little grumpy. Yeah, he's usually <laughs> just like toy. What is that? <laughs> so my favorite part of the day was chilling with Peanut. I think he's super cool. Yeah, you do. And cute. You think he's, he's super cute cool? Too. He's super cool. If you watched this far in the video, I'm gonna let you know now if you got the challenge correct or not. The answer to the challenge of the day was it was Jesse and he shaved his beard. And it's a huge difference. When Ada first saw it, she freaked out. She's like, Dad, that what did you do? Trim. Same difference. Thank you guys so much for watching. We'll see you in the next one. We post new videos every single week, uh, usually like Monday to Friday with a missed day here or there, but Monday to Friday afternoons. We'll see you in the next one. Remember to eat your pickles, kids. Say eat your pickles, kids. <laughs> the angle looks so funny. Woo, hey.